video, I'm going to talk about uh, what is the main thing that give a numismatic collection value. I've spoken to many people. Uh, some say it's about the rarity. Uh, some say it's a precious matter, and some say it's the art. Uh, to me, it's about how historical important it is to give it value. Uh, other factor like the art, the rarity, or any other you think of actually play very little in deciding the value. I will take the 2000 Thomas Cup silver coin as an example. Do you know uh, there are actually 20,000 pieces issued by uh, uh, Benga Malaysia compared to other silver coin like the 2001 uh, CK which Benga uh, Malaysia issued only 3000 pieces. Uh, it was only it was able to sell as high as two thousand ringgit. Yet the two thousand one C game uh, silver coin only able to sell as high as three hundred ringgit. The reason is during the ninety period Thomas Cup event, uh, it was a golden age for Malaysia badminton. It is historically important to all Malaysia. That even non collector buy it to remember that period. I mean, if tomorrow, uh, Ben Guy Malaysia issue 100 coin about me, will you buy it to collect? The answer will mostly be no, unless you are a hardcore fan of mine. The numismatic collection has always been about uh, history. Don't collect just because you read in a newspaper about certain old coin can sell at very high price or you saw someone post an I one coin for sales at 50,000 uh, ringgit don't, be co don't collect because someone said the value will go up in the future of course if it go up then uh, good for you uh, instead join because of the history the thing that gave it value is the story behind it. I hope this video will change the way you see about the numismatic collection. And uh, that's it for this video. If you like what I do, don't forget to like my video and subscribe to my channel. And have a nice day everyone. Goodbye.